What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Hopefully y'all had a great Thanksgiving, but it's officially time to start shopping for Christmas if you haven't already. I've come up with a little bit of a buyer's guide here. I went shopping on my own shop here, kind of picked out a few items that I would recommend that anybody looking to buy their favorite fisherman or even yourself if you want to just buy a gift for yourself. I picked out a little guide that a few items that I feel like are, are uh, really good equipment, baits, apparel, accessories, all different types of things here in this little buyer's guide. So hopefully anybody watching can find a little piece, a little gift, something in here to buy for your favorite fisherman and uh, just, you know, make the holidays great. So we've kind of categ categorized it into a couple different sections. You know, we got some, some more expensive items and then all the way down to uh, just a couple dollars, little stocking stuffers or, or little gifts to, to give out to anybody. So we got all sorts of different products here. So we're going to jump in and, and go through the whole buyer's guide and uh, hopefully you guys find something that, that you need. All right, first thing on the list, and, and actually this is going to be the most expensive item that I put on this list. And, you know, there's a couple different models of this but this is the brand new Bubba scale so this is the pro series smart scale um, this one's really cool it connects to your phone it can share every fish catch to like a, a group or a tournament so if you and a couple of your buddies get this same scale you can uh, you know kind of have a, a major league fishing style tournament just by hooking your phone up to this scale so there's the pro series and then there is a, a uh, what is it called just a smart scale I believe um, the, the Pro Series retails for $200 and the, the Pro Series or the Fish Smart scale retails for $100. So there's two different options, but it is a legit scale. You know, you, you don't want to be the guy that goes out and catches that big giant fish and doesn't have a scale in the boat. You got to be able to weigh it so you know how big that fish was so you can tell the fish story and get those good pictures. So having a scale in the boat is a must. You know, like I said, there's two different models here, this bubble one. Actually, this is the scale we're gonna be using on the Bass Pro Tour going forward. So you're gonna see this all over Major League Fishing next year. And uh, it's just a really nice scale. Works really well and it's extremely accurate. I've been using it for a few months now and I'm really impressed with the Bubba scale. So like I said, there's a $200 option and a $100 option in the Bubba scale, but definitely a great gift for any fisherman in your family. All right, next up is a brand new fishing rod. Everyone loves a new fishing rod for Christmas. And this right here, this is the favorite Defender series. So it's very patriotic. You can see the colors on it. It is a beautiful rod. Um, there's a, a casting and a spinning rod. There are a couple different models. The one I would suggest for all around good use would be this one right here. This is the seven foot medium heavy model. So it is a, just a perfect all around use rod. You know, you can get somebody this casting rod right here and uh, they can use it for a variety of different techniques, all different kinds of baits, catch a bunch of fish with this right here. So the Defender Series always makes the lineup for a buying guide. It is just such a good value rod. You know, it's, it's fairly priced. You know, it's, it's I think $109.99 retail and uh, just a great rod for that price. So you can get a good rod, fairly cheap, and uh, be able to use a variety of different techniques with it. So like I said, casting or spinning model, um, you can't go wrong with any of those in the favorite Defender lineup. So next up, um, we're gonna go into some clothing. Can't, probably can't see, but these right here, these are the Striker tournament grade shorts. I wear these shorts just about every day, and they're a great gift for anybody out there who, who gets on the water. So the cool thing about the Striker shorts is they're made uh, from a kind of a neoprene-ish material where you could jump in the lake and get out and they're going to be dry within just a few minutes. So they dry really quick. They keep you cool and uh, just perfect, comfortable shorts to wear out on the lake or wherever you're going fishing. So the striker tournament shorts definitely make the list. All right, moving on. Next up will be, of course, 
if you're ordering from Fish USA, you gotta get some swag, and that'd be this hoodie right here. It's actually on sale right now. So if you're if you uh, if you like this hoodie, if you wanna check out all the other gear at Fish USA, everybody loves a, a nice hoodie, and uh, Fish USA has some really cool looking stuff there. So you can check out a, a, all the apparel at Fish USA. Next up, this is gonna be for all my cold weather fishermen, and this is something that took me a little coming around to you know I never really liked fishing with gloves until I started wearing these right here and it's the striker wool gloves so these are fingerless gloves so you can still fish you can feel everything but literally you could wear these in the coldest conditions and your hands are not going to be cold um, you could literally dunk your hands in the lake in the water and these are still going to keep you warm you know wool gloves are great for on the water just because they repel the water so well and keep you warm even if they're soaking wet so these are by far the my favorite gloves i've ever worn and the striker wool gloves be a great gift for anybody out there looking to uh stay warm while they're out fishing not not even fishing you could you could wear these day-to-day -day life if you're out working you know you're just going out to the car going to work whatever you could wear the the striker wool gloves and, and keep your hands warm this winter all right, moving on next, we're going into some accessories. So, you know, there is a lot of options out there for accessories, but Fish USA has some really awesome accessories here, some tools. So this is the Fish USA pliers. Now these things are just a, a one-stop tool for everything you need to do. You need to cut some line, you got a line cutter right there. You need to change out some split rings. It's got a split ring notch on the top. You can do that. You need to just unhook some fish. You need to crimp something. You need to strip some wire for some reason. I mean, this set of pliers right here does so many things and you could literally just buy this one pair of pliers, keep them in your boat or in your tackle box and you're gonna be covered no matter the situation that comes up. So these right here, these are called the Fish USA Ultimate Aluminum Pliers. I keep a couple sets in my boat and uh, I think everybody who fishes should have a pair of these pliers right here. They're an excellent tool to keep in the boat. And going along with that is this right here. This is the Fish USA Braid Scissors. So, you know, maybe you already have a good set of pliers and you just need a good pair of scissors. This right here, this is the Fish USA Braid Scissors. They're made for cutting braid, but they will cut through any piece of line like butter. I mean, you could literally take a piece of braid in there and it will just cut it off like butter. Smooth and uh, great durable set of pliers. You know, I've had a pair of these in my boat since they've come out for, I guess, going on three years now. And uh, they have not rusted. They have not worn down. They've been excellent. So this is like a one-time buy. You get yourself a good pair of scissors and a uh, great stocking stuffer. You know, these are pretty cheap and you can get these and uh, always have something available to cut your line, cut your braid, whatever you need to do. Good pair of scissors is a must have in the boat or your tackle box. All right, let's move on to some fun stuff. Now we're getting into the tackle. You know, the, everyone loves the baits, the uh, things that actually catch the fish for you. And uh, these are a few of my recommendations on baits that I think you could buy for anybody and they could go out and catch some bass on any of these baits I'm about to mention right here. So. Let's start with uh, a crankbait. So this is the Bill Lewis MR6 right here. You know, a couple of my favorite colors would be citrus shad, any sort of red crawfish color. And then this one right here might be one of my favorites. It's called Cellmate. Um, excellent little crankbaits. You know, these dive down to about six feet and you can take these, cast them, wind them, and catch bass on these anywhere in the country. So these would be some great stocking stuffers, great gifts for any of your fishermen in your life. Going along with that, here's another universal bait that just catches fish all over the country, and that's a steel shad blade bait. These are so simple to fish, it doesn't matter what species you're fishing for, what time of year, what part of the country, you could take one of these baits right here, tie them on, and you're gonna catch some fish. Fresh water, salt water, it doesn't matter. This right here is probably one of the most universal baits made 
So you could literally get yourself a couple of these, take them anywhere you want to go, and you're going to catch some bass on a steel shad lure right there. So they are a must buy if you're looking to get something new for your favorite fisherman. All right, let's move into some plastics here. You know, if you're looking to get a few worms, it's hard to beat the original Yamamoto Senko. This bait is so simple to fish, and it's another one of those baits where you could literally buy it for anybody. Give them this pack of baits with a pack of hooks, and they could rig it up and go catch a bass. And, and that's what it's all about. You know, that's what I want to see from, from this whole guide is somebody being able to pick up some of this tackle, give it to a friend, a family member, whoever, and they're going to rig this stuff up and instantly catch fish. You know, these are top of the line baits that, that you can't go wrong with. So a few of my favorite colors in the Cinco would be this guy right here. This is mowed grass. It's just a very natural looking color. It's got some blue and purple fleck in it, so it really looks good. And then be my signature color right here. This would be for your little bit dirtier water. It's Becker's Black Magic. So it's black and blue with some silver flakes. So it really shines nice and uh, puts off a, a flash in the water. And uh, you can take this anywhere and catch some bass on it. So those are a couple favor of my favorite colors in the Cinco. Next up will be for, for all my, my smallmouth guys. So if you're anywhere up north or wanting to catch some more smallmouth, up your drop shot game, these guys right here, the Yamamoto Shad Shape Worm, they're such a, a great profiled bait. You know, they look just like a little shad and they imitate everything the bass eats so well. So you got these nice little baits right here. This is the green pumpkin color. Excellent all around color. So if I had to pick one bait to buy, it would be these green pumpkin shad shaped worms. And then for your guys on the Great Lakes or really anywhere in the country, there's another signature color right here, Becker's Magic Juice, which is basically the green pumpkin with a little bit of shad mixed in. So it's an excellent color for anyone to try if they want to drop shot. All right, another bait that is a must have. Every bass fisherman should have one of these right here and it is a chatterbait. This is the Z-Man Evergreen Jackhammer chatterbait. So it's a it's a higher end bait. I think this bait is a, a $15 bait here. So it, it's gonna be a more expensive bait, but this is the top of the line, the best chatterbait on the market right here. So you're able to get one of these and uh, put a trailer on here, a Yamamoto Zeko. This is the three inch Zeko. So this is the spot remover color jackhammer and the disco green color Zeko trailer. You pair these two together for uh, under $25 and you have a excellent fish catching setup right here. So that's a perfect gift for somebody right there. All right, next up we got a few hooks. So I love using Eagle Claw Trocar hooks, and that's what we got right here. So we got a few different versions. This one is the HD worm hook. So this would be the hook to use with your Senkos. So you can pair these two together. I like the three aught size. That's what we have right here. And uh, that'll pair up well with this five inch Senko. And uh, these two pair to together perfectly. Next up, we have the drop shot hook. So this is the hook you would want to use on your shad shaped worm right here. So we would pair these two together and then add into that a drop shot weight. Epic tungsten 3 a ounce drop shot weight. So this right here is the full setup you need to go drop shotting. Again, it's going to be under $20 your setup to go catch a bunch of bass throwing a drop shot rig. Next hook we have here, this is the finesse hook. So this is another hook for your Cinco that you can pair together. And this is gonna be for what's called wacky rigging. And that's when you hook the bait in, you, you rig the bait in the middle of the bait. So kind of uh, hook it a little differently, a different style rig. And uh, it's a great way to catch a lot of fish. If you're pond fishing or, or fishing off the bank, you know, the wacky rig's a great way to go. So this is when you would pair these two together right here. All right, I think that's just about it. We got one more little thing right here, and, and this, this is a, a show stealer right here. This is probably the cheapest item on the entire guide, 
and it's going to make all of your fishermen happy right here. And it's the Eagle Claw hat hook. So it, it is a perfect accessory to add on to your hat. It's just a little clip. I have the, uh, the red, white, and blue version here. But essentially, this thing just clips right on the top of your hat. And that way you got a hook on the top of your hat at all times. It's just a little accessory to, to let people know that, that you're a fisherman. And uh, I think it's a really cool little gift that you could get, throw it in a stocking, throw it, throw it anywhere, you know, get, get a few for all the fishermen you know in your life. And uh, it's a cool little piece that I think a lot of people will enjoy. So hopefully you guys found something here to uh, buy for your favorite fishermen. And uh, hopefully we helped you out a little bit. I know it's it's overwhelming when when you start looking at the tackle store like Fish USA. There's so many options and so many different baits. So hopefully we narrowed it down and, and helped you out a little bit to uh, pick out a few things for for your family members or your favorite fishermen. And uh, appreciate you guys watching. Leave me those likes and comments down below, and uh, we'll see you guys next time.